Hi, I'm Actipav, and by the title of the video, you can probably guess, I'm going to be guessing secondhand market prices of dolls, pre-existing ones. Usually they're not ones that are currently in the market, because obviously then that would just be store prices, but anyway, so secondhand market doll prices. Um, I haven't done one in a while, so I'm pretty excited. Um, so yeah. Let's just jump right in. I'm going to be doing it a little bit differently. Uh, so like usually I sit down and then I'm like on my computer and I'm like looking at them. Uh, we're going to then jump to like the eBay listings, Bakari, whatever it is that will be put in here and then jump back. Okay. So I hope that it's a little bit easier for like editing and I'm not just kind of staring at the thing being like, Ugh. like you'll still be um, seeing the eBay listings with me for the first time, but I won't have like. I don't know, sometimes I just sit in silence and it's like, okay. So let's begin with our first one. We have Malville dolls. And from my remembrance of these dolls, if I can remember them correctly, um, they're, they're fun. I don't know too much about them. Like I like I've talked about it before in other videos I'm doing like lots of research on different dolls and stuff and especially ones that I don't know a lot about like it means I haven't been researching uh you know you can only research so many at once so I don't hear a lot of people talk about them too much um and because of that like a doll that isn't super like I don't see videos pop up or like posts of people commenting about them being like hard to find or anything i'm gonna go with they're gonna be like your average retail price for a doll so like 20 to 30 dollars i'm gonna say new in box um 20 to 30 i didn't i don't typically do like new in box or i do typically do that don't i okay we're gonna go like 20 out of box 30 in box that's gonna be my price okay Okay, it, yeah, I hope, I hope. Okay, so I literally can only find one listing on eBay, and that's a lot. There are 10 people watching it, which is kind of surprising. However, you might be screaming at me. I did not know you could still buy these dolls. Like, you can still, there's still a website, and you can actively still buy them. So, as like, this one is, like, $400. Um, but the other ones were retail price, which is some were $20, some were, like, $25. I didn't think if I put it on, um, uh, like maybe it'll show sorry i'm trying to find sold items nothing i thought i spelled it right i also am saying it wrong um it's that's not how you spell it um there's an a i was saying malville malville but it's malville i don't i don't know how to say the actual word but um i was saying it wrong for sure uh i didn't think i was even like sound spelling it anyways so I don't know if to count that as like, yeah, I got it right because I guess 20 to 30 and you can still actually buy them. Is that fair? I don't know. However, there was a $400 one on here, uh, listed at least. Um, so I don't, I don't know. You can decide if it counts or not. Probably not. But yeah, if you are interested in them, cause I'm interested in them. You can apparently still buy them on a website. Let me know if, if you can. Or if I'm just dumb. Anyways, yeah. Okay, so the next one, I'm hoping that I can get through more than three dolls, which is usually what I do, or three doll brands. Um, but let's begin. We have Babysitter Club, and I love these dolls. I'm going off, oh, there's different kinds of Babysitter Club dolls. Okay, so for, we're going to do both here so for the big dolls um the bigger size ones i'm gonna say around that 30 oh that's a big we'll go 40 to 50 dollar price point i know that there are like one or two of the dolls that are easier to find um and aren't as much money but yeah we're gonna we're gonna go with that um 40 to 50 I was gonna say 30 but I think 
what's her face like I know so we're gonna like get rid of the outliers for the other ones I don't really see too many posts about babysitter club in general um which makes it difficult um let alone like the the barbie-esque ones barbie um size i don't i don't know what brand makes it it's not mattel uh, i don't think so um i don't see too much on that we're gonna go higher like 60 to 70 i know that like i said like when a doll i don't see too many i'm gonna price it a lot lower but i don't i don't know for those i do know a little bit of the bigger ones just because I really want them so sometimes I look up prices for them um I don't know if I'm gonna be right with that one but specific specific dolls but I don't know about the other ones I don't really look up them as much uh they'll pop up but I, I don't remember what I see for their prices so I, I think I'm gonna be off with the other ones but yeah Okay, so to be honest, I can't remember specifically what I said for these, but these are not a bad price. I think I thought they were a lot higher than what they were, um, which is about $40 for these ones so far. Um, we're not seeing the ones with the little kids that they come with yet, um, but this is one that I have, and she also, she's pre-owned, so she's missing her little jacket, but then right below it, we have a Christie. It's made by Jenner. Um, Kenner. Why did I say Jenner? It's Kenner. Um, <laughs> they're about with shipping, um, like almost $40. Um, I was gonna say I'd count that, but I guess, oh, no, I did. 40 to 50, a little bit under 40. Um, but that is for Christy, who is the most popular, which is making me a little nervous. Oh, um, I love how they wrote rare babysitter club doll, vice president Claudia, and she's $35. Oh, this is bad. Cause I know some of them are a little bit, well, okay, here's a 40 to $50 one. Oops, sorry. So in like the 30 to 50 price range, which was what I was originally going to guess, but I was like, that's way too far off. Okay, so we have one that is 110 or $11, I guess, plus $15 shipping. Um, that's insane. I did know that some of these were listed a little high. We have a Dawn wearing Christie's outfit. We have Claudia. I was just making fun of this one uh we saw before there was the other claudia like pretty much same condition i feel um and she chose that listing had the word rare in it and it was cheaper than this one that doesn't have rare in it and is way more money um we have a another like a little doll that's 24 like smaller like barbie sized doll um that's like 24 for with 14 dollars shipping we have a christy I think it's Christy, yeah, Christy for $40 plus 15 shipping. Um, a lot of them, that's so f cool. Um, we're finally getting to like a little bit of the higher prices, which is what I remember them being at, like higher. Um, I'm surprised they're this low because I need to go and buy them. Um, $50 for, it's not Dawn, is it? It's the other one. I don't remember her name. Maybe it is Dawn. I don't. I don't, I don't remember who this is. It's not listed, but $50, that's a lot. And then there's a Mary Ann. I really want Mary Ann's character. Um, but she's $20 plus 11 shipping and she's out of box. Um, and then Stacy. See, that's who I was thinking that one was, but now I don't think, I guess that could be Dawn. I was thinking she was Stacy, but that's, I don't know why I clicked on three. We are getting some others. So you're getting a lot of prices. I don't remember what I said for the smaller size dolls. I'm just going to make that clear. Um, I don't know if I should count it either because I guess 40 to 50 and they range from like 30 to 50 dollars. Um, so again, up to you to decide. But yeah. There is, I guess I could look at, I didn't do filtered, um, filter, this also shows you how to look for f completed items, there we go, 110, oops, not completed, that's my bad, <laughs> show more, uh, sold items, there we go, um, see, Marianne sold for out of box, like, 20 bucks, um, Claudia sold for 30 bucks. Uh, Christy, undetermined. A uh, Christy for 50. That's, oh, I love Christy. That's one that I have. Um, her hair is cut though, so. Um, Claudia for 50. 
Um, and then the little ones, we're not seeing too many of the little ones. They must not sell too much. We got a Mallory for 25. Um, yeah. Oh, who is that? Mallory. We, we didn't see a Mallory looking through. See, she's a little bit more expensive as you can tell, but yeah, you can get, get kind of an idea of how much they actually are. We also didn't see a Jesse either in when I was looking. Um, so you can kind of get an idea, but yeah, that is babysitter club dolls let's go to the next doll okay next we have funky tweens um sorry I drew before <laughs> um these ones are difficult um because I don't see too many and I don't think that I'm gonna be able to find many listings of funky tweens um they are I hear people refer reference them as like brats not cross but honestly I don't think they look a lot like brats um but maybe that's just me um I feel like if anything when I have the hardest time finding them listed um I was thinking like 50 I realized I was not putting them out of box um 50 to 60 maybe out of box uh and then like 80 inbox I just don't see too many people referencing them so I want to say lower but I feel like they're I feel like that's that's gonna be my my pricing for them I feel like they're gonna be so much and <laughs> that is devastating okay that that is my that is my guess um I really like funky tea tween sorry um but I, I just don't see them listed a lot or many people talk about them um and then when people do like every once in a while talk about them like I feel like either people hate on them so that's why I'm kind of thinking maybe they're supposed to be lower we're gonna go with a 50 to 60 out of box I feel like I'm gonna be off with that one as I guessed they are not popping up I'm not surprised um I did find a few listings um it looked like from like a different country. They said that they were out of stock. I think they just don't ship to the US. Um, but like if you go onto photos, you can see them. Um, but I'm going to say that means that I can't get it right or wrong because they don't have listings. It also doesn't mean that the item is like priceless or anything. I want to say that. Um, it just means that it... I don't know. It means that... They weren't super common, so a lot of people don't have them, or who do have them don't want to sell them. I don't know. I just feel like sometimes, like, there's dolls that I can't find, and I'm like, I've seen them listed before, and they're not, like, a million dollars, so keep that in mind. It might just mean that, like, they didn't sell well, so people don't sell them on ebay also i don't know how much they go for i did see a reddit post of somebody talking about how a nude one sold for like 500 dollars, and people are like uh no um but i i don't personally know i do know like i follow somebody who does purchase them but i don't i don't know what they they buy them for um and i don't know if it's easier to get them in other countries or anything so keep that in mind it could be that i live in the u.s and i don't i don't know where they were sold so keep that in mind but yeah Funky tweens was a no-go. Last drawing possibly for the video. I don't know. I don't know how many um, we'll find here. Like we'll be able to fit in. But maybe it'll go by a little bit faster now that I'm not scrolling as much. But we'll just do this one. Um, so we have Spectra. Not Spectra from Monster High. But the Spectra lineup okay I'm gonna have to probably check but I'm pretty sure that's the one dolls that are like shiny like they look like they have metallic skin but I could be wrong with that if I'm thinking of that particular doll line if that's what it's called if that's spectra I'm gonna go with <sighs> again we're getting like doll lines that I don't I don't care too often of I'm going to say like that 30 to 40 dollar price point so a little bit over retail I just don't see too many people talk about them I don't know if they're they were popular when they were or what um but I, I don't really think I see them get mentioned at all so I'm gonna say they're not as much of a loved line but I feel like with today, like, I feel like I'm a little off with some of these guesses. So maybe we'll see that they're 
a lot higher, but I'm going to say 30 to 40 for for those ones, so. I did not know that Mattel made the Spectra doll. Like, I'm very surprised. I also want to remind you that I guess 30 to $40. These are not 30 to $40, and I'm kind of disappointed because I wasn't super obsessed with them. Like, yes, I think they're a cool concept, but, like, I wasn't that obsessed. I was like, maybe I'll be able to get my hands on one, but, like... <laughs> That's a lot. Um, a lot of times I guess low because I want I want that to be the case. That is a brand new one in box. I mean, they're cool. Why do they have to be so expensive? Okay, here's another one. I do like the other color, like the blue. Astra Gold Mattel Spectra Doll. Uh, 99 or plus 10 shipping. Keep that in mind. Um, also, you can you can clearly see that other Spectras are coming up, and that's okay. Um, now, mind you, just because somebody prices a doll at a price does not mean that people are paying that price. Keep that in mind. Let's, let's go see sold items. Anyone? Spectra. I could have typed in, like, the Mattel 19, I think... 86 is what some of them are listed as, but I did not. Doll 1986. Okay, here we are for seeing some. Uh, on March 21, 21st, it sold for $130 plus $15 shipping. However, we are seeing some lesser um, prices, possible. I don't think that's her outfit, but maybe it is. Uh, for 15 plus 8 shipping. There were two bids on that one. That one is 50 and they're out of box we've got like $80 oh my gosh okay there is one down there that sold for March 8 and it's roughly like 40 which isn't bad right is that 40 26 plus 36 yeah like $40 which would be the highest because I guess 30 to 40 I'm very off with this one uh because I feel like I said that for out of or inbox but that's not great um hundred dollars yeah I'm gonna go some like fifty dollars up to a hundred oh that's I never get my hands on them but that's okay that's okay we can want things is that a boy there's a boy one I didn't know that they made a boy okay I was definitely off with that price what what did you guess for your guys's because I don't think I'm winning today's round of second hand doll market prices guessing game so that was the end of this video this part i don't know what part we're on um but let's just say we did not get funky tweens right because we couldn't find any by we i mean me um so fail i'm gonna assume they're a lot higher than what i guessed uh, especially with the reddit post that i saw of the nude one and then spectra i got way off and then babysitter club i don't remember what i said for the ones but i'm gonna partially count i'm gonna count i'm gonna count babysitter club uh and then well i don't know the first one because i called them malville but i don't think that's how you say it i don't think that's how you say it at all um i'm very off with that name so please please comment what it is please tell me um but uh i'm gonna count it even though i did not know you could still buy them and partially cheating so yeah anyways max pab thanks for watching let me know your thoughts on second hand market doll prices are they annoying do you hate them as much as i do anyways i'm max pab thanks for watching and i hope you enjoyed bye